The goal of this procedure is to show how to evaluate the ability of some immunomodulatory molecules, such as antimicrobial peptides, to stimulate cell migration, which is a rate-limiting event during the wound healing process. Generally speaking, the basic procedure to study cell migration in vitro involves the creation of cell monolayer, the production of cell wound, the capture of images at different time intervals until wound close is reached, and analysis of the image sequence to quantify cell migration. Now, the advantage of this method of the classic assay, which is based on a manually made scratch, is due to the usage of special silicon culture inserts to create a pseudo wound field which is completely free of cells and with a very well defined width, 500 micrometers. In addition, thanks to a web based automatic image analysis program, it is possible to rapidly receive within minutes quantitative data on the speed of wound closure and cell migration. So overall, this is a reliable experimental technique that can be applied to any kind of adherent cells with very high reproducibility of data. Here it is provided as an example the fact of a frost skin antimicrobial peptide on the migration of bronchial epithelial cells and how pretreatment of these cells with specific inhibitors can give information on the molecular mechanism underlying such events. More precisely, it will be shown how the peptide-induced cell migration involves activation of epidermal growth factor receptor. To begin the experiment, remove the flask containing cells from the cell culture incubator and check the cell confluence on an inverted microscope equipped with an automatic image acquisition system. If 90% of complete confluence is reached, move to a biosafety hood and carefully aspirate the culture medium using a 10 ml plastic pipette under sterile conditions. And gently discard the medium into a waste bottle. Wash the cells with 6 ml PBS without calcium and magnesium that is CMS.